Hey hello everybody, my name is Kedemar, welcome back for another video of Total War Attila. We're back with this series, boys, of course. Now that uh, yesterday we finished, in two hours, we finished uh, basically the first episode of The Walking Dead. So we're coming back to the series we already were doing. So let's re make a recap because it's been a week since, it's been a long time since I played this game. And I don't know, I don't quite remember what I was doing. I know that I have, okay, I have all these territories. I have uh, this over Britain as well. So, okay, I have the army of the king protecting this area. So, the army of the king, I guess, is going to be the army that's going to be here. There's a couple of soldiers I got to upgrade right here. There we go. Um, anything else really doesn't look like it. I mean, I do have a couple of soldiers I need to equip. Just making sure that that is all done. Okay, we're good here. So, but aside from that, nothing really. I think uh, the turn is... I just had to complete my turn and everything. I'm using this army probably to attack these guys. They've got two cities. Uh, let's see if we got any allies. We don't have any allies. Alright, so that's uh, okay. We gotta, we're got we gonna have to deal with all this. We did uh, make a battle in the last video. Which I think ended up with us winning, of course. So... Uh, now we're just going to go ahead and go f straight for border, uh, border just and Bells. And we're going to take these two cities in this video, boys, or these two regions. We're going to uh, upgrade our empire, basically, like all the other videos. It's going to be fun. Um, I think we're going to have a little bit of fun. We're going to have some, uh, some strange time a little bit. Uh, I don't know how far we're going to get into this video exactly. We'll just have to see, I guess. Since it's been a while since I played, I gotta kind of gotta recap myself a little bit, uh, know what I was doing and stuff. Aside from that, we should be all fine. We're into the next turn, and now it's time to research for uh, search for a new research, basically. So uh, here we go. Uh, I don't have time to re uh, to check for to upgrade my armies, basically. So I'm not gonna waste my time on that. We are gonna upgrade our cities that's for sure though every time we get a new sort of upgrade we gotta do it boys that's for sure we got so many like our empire is really strong now it's uh it's impressive how far i can go with op uh mods basically boys how far i can upgrade myself as quick as possible really because it's, it's unbelievable really i not so long ago you won't be able to to do that, uh, to go so fast and uh, have so many cities and stuff so quick. Now my army here is complete, so that's good. We're gonna be able to defeat the, to go against the angles once I'm done with these guys right here. So let's go ahead and take care of these guys. I'm gonna make it quicker. There we go. So they've got. Oh, they do. They do have a bunch. Uh, a big army. They do have a big army. Uh, Burdages. Should I do the battle, boys? I don't know. Don't know if I should do the battle. Don't feel like doing any battles in this video because I'm kind of getting used to it again. But, you know, it's part of Total War. You got to do the battles if you want to play the game. I don't know. We're going to have to siege anyways first. So, might as well. We got a battering ram. We got a siege tower. I think this is a, yeah, this is the thing though. This is a tower, yeah, it's a fortress, so I'm not gonna attack. If it's a fortress, I'm not attacking. So, we already have our answer right here. I'm not attacking since it's a fortress. We're gonna go over here, unlock all the cities, uh, or try to do it as, uh, at least. There we go. We already know a bunch of territory, like all, a bunch of story. What's the story with our family? So we're still Faramund's still a king at 52 years of age. He still have a, he does have a son, which is 11 years uh, of age. We have uh, Claudio, which is the son of the uh, heir for now, which is Tudemir, one of the brothers, uh, the elder brother, 45, uh, 44 years of age, and we've got the other brother, which is 40 years of age. Uh, this guy's already in the chambers. This one as well. We can't put him in. Is there any of them? We can't. Alright, so 
We're good boys, the family is big and strong, we're doing fine, we're just gonna skip the turns, uh, do the battles and the stuff and don't do anything else really, we just, there's nothing really we can do. I hope these, uh, I hope you can see the rebel army right here in London. I hope they take London so that I can actually take London afterwards from the rebels and have a little bit more cities. I mean, more regions is the best, really. We've got the Oons, which are really close to my territories, my regions, um, right now. I'm not sure if that's a good thing or not. Well, they're not going to attack me, that's for sure. But nonetheless, I mean, having nomads close to your territories is never a good thing. They want to trade. Why not? I'm going to give them money. I don't care. I have so much money. Um, I can spend it wherever I want, basically. Let's do this, boys. We're in the next turn again. Um, we got another territory, another thing to do. There we go. So we got all re our research done. And now we can focus on attacking already. Um, now, if I attack right now, which the settlement strength, wall strength is 93 and, and stuff. So if they've got walls, they've got uh, stuff protecting themselves. So I'm not going to attack because I don't want to attack walls, boys. I really don't. Um, the only time I'm going to actually do the battles is if I'm in a plane and stuff. Uh, just like I did in the previous video. I don't want to attack the cities because the cities do have walls and stuff. And I I'm not interested in that. I really hate invading all the uh, walls and stuff. So we've got... Do we have more arrows? No, it's kind of balanced. So let's balance it out. Now let's balance it out and we should be good, yeah. Lost a lot of soldiers there. We're gonna occupy the place, of course. Repair all of this. Now, we do already have pretty much everything in here, so... We all also have a religion, we don't need that. So, sanitation, we're gonna do that. We are gonna go ahead and upgrade our general. He's got some new points. We're gonna give him more armor and... Give him some bonus points right here. Let's give him, I guess, let's give him that fatigue rate. Now, let's see our our armies. We do need to upgrade them uh, pretty quick. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to go ahead and, uh, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and merge them so they can be whole pretty uh, better in a better way, but quicker way. So... Um, I'm gonna need just more archers plainly, so let's just get these archers done for right here Yeah, let's just get these archers uh, In two turns uh, in one turn after this turn basically they're gonna be ready and we're gonna be basically ready to attack bells Once we get bells, I think it's good. We're gonna be done with these guys probably I think we're it's gonna be the case right we're gonna be done with uh, Yeah, the Lugans it's Basically, the only territory that they have left, so that's pretty good. Uh, what about over here? I want to see everywhere. I want to make sure that uh, I take a look at, at the world, entire world, every time. Because you, you never know. There might be some um, rebel armies right here who try to uh, rebel, basically. And you, you get uh, a chance to invade these cities. So, not yet. They are attacking, they are sieging London, so it's just a matter of time before they actually get it. So we gotta be prepared nonetheless. 53 years of age now. I'm really hoping that he's gonna survive until my actual son is ready to be on the throne. Like he's ready to be an heir and stuff. Because if it's not the case, we're gonna be uh, in trouble, boys. I really need... Like I really need him to be ready and stuff let's upgrade these guys there we go let's just uh, skip to the next turn again we're in 400 uh, we're gonna be in 419 so almost 420 boys we're moving pretty quick um we're doing a really fast work really good work it's uh it's really pleasing for me to see that our empires go on are growing pretty fast and strong we got a faction that got destroyed. Uh, Worthy Bride, sure, you can get her, give blessing. Um, let's get another technology out of the way. There we go. 
So we can upgrade to a bunch of cities now, actually. That this is all done. So let's go around our cities and upgrade all of them. There we go. We don't have anything here. We do have something in here that we got to upgrade. Uh, in Colonia as well. There we go. And Flevum. There we go. Our capital. Now, I don't know if I can actually move my capital. I think this is one of the things I would have liked to do. Is to be able to move my capitals. Uh, move the capitals, right? So, if you want... Like, you have a capital you don't want. You want to switch it to a better place. Like, it would be fun to just switch it. Or actually... Oh, they're dead. Is, are they... Like, are the Rugians dead or something? Oh, these, this is the faction that I was at war with. Okay, so the Rurgans are dead, um, boys. So, now that that is done, I guess what I'm going to have to do is move my army that's over here in Burdigis because uh, Uyum is already protected in, uh, in here. So, I might have to... Actually, what I might have to do, boys... Do I need Uyum? I don't need Uyum, so I'm going to move Uyum. I'm going to move it over here. I'm going to move this army. I'm going to move it back to uh, Belts. So, uh, it's basically the Russians who have that, the Venetians, uh, Vene the or whatever their name is. The so, we're going to switch, we're going to switch uh, names with them, uh, switch cities with them. There we go. Now we have Belts. And they have Eum, alright? So Belts is ours. Uh, they do have a religion and a city, of course. So we're going to get the food. Best food possible. There we go. Now, we're going to get this army as well over to uh, Nitraha. Uh, Ra. These names are really weird, boys. But let's get this army to the south. This army is going to retreat here because it's the army that's going to protect us from the east, of course. We have our army protecting us from uh, the west and the one from the north. Now the one from the north, we're going to uh, use it right now to declare war on the Angles, which uh, the Angles only have one city. I want to make sure. Uh, Angles only have one city. It's going to be pretty easy. We're going to probably defeat them in this turn. So let's go ahead and uh, do that right away, boys. Declare war to them. There we go. We're declaring war to them. And, okay, this is going to be a tough battle. Uh, they don't have any walls. So, it is in the plain. They have a lot of... A big army. Uh, an army that is really destroyed, though. So, we're, it's going to be pretty easy for us to defeat them. Uh, yeah, let's do that battle. We're going to do that battle in real time, boys. Let's do this. Let's do this, boys. I'm ready. Um, I already completed the formation and stuff. Uh, let's start attacking with this unit right here. I want to attack uh, the walls. I don't know if they've got the range or not. Yeah, they do. They do have the range. Um, now, I don't know how it's going to go. Are they going to uh, be able to do anything? I, we'll see how it goes. I'm going to start attacking as well uh, this army right here. I've got catapults, so I can basically attack them and... Really do a bunch of damage to them. Uh, barrage, no. Uh, what? Drop Siege? No, I don't want to do that. So these are flaming rounds. Not really. Okay, I want all my units right now. To attack these guys. There we go. There we, there we go. They're doing a lot of damage. Look at my units, boys. How much damage they're doing, basically. It's unbelievable. We, de we demolished them. Literally demolish them. They can't even get past us. There we go. They, they can't get past us. Look at that damage. Holy. Holy good God, boys. Okay. Attack them. Attack them. Attack them. They're attacking my uh, my goddamn catapult. That's not good. There we go. They're going to be done for. They're going to be done for. I've got uh, one of my archers... Uh, doing the work right here. I want all of my archers actually to be precision shot right here. There we go. Just attack. There we go. 
Just attack like crazy. Now these guys, these units, uh, I'm gonna just tell them, I guess, to attack. No, I don't want, oh. I need them to be back onto their things. There we go. Get back into your catapults. They were, uh, they, they went away from it for some reason, and I don't know why. There we go. Attack it. Uh, I'm gonna give some points. Um, steady. There we go. Steady, everyone. There we go. Now, everybody, make your move. They can't even get past. That's the thing. That's why we're so OP. This, they can't even get past, like, get close uh, to our armies, our actual soldiers. That's why we're so OP right now. Um, I want you guys to be... Actually, I want you guys to start moving because... There we go. Start moving, boys. Uh, actually, the entire formation. Because I knew you were a uh, create selected group. Oh, th that's not what I wanted at all. Anyan. No, that's not what I wanted. Okay. What I want is for you guys to be ri right here. I want my archers to be like this. And I want my, I guess, my general right here. We're gonna start attacking, I guess. Uh, we're gonna attack over here. Attack uh, all of this uh, nonsense. Uh, fire at will. There we go. Fire at will. And I'm gonna actually ask, uh, ask these guys right here to s skirmish mode. No. Whistling shot. I feel like they're doing fine, so I'm gonna not gonna ask them to do too much. You do, we're, we're doing fine, boys. Um, as for them. There we go. I'm making them fear us a little bit. Loose spacing minimizes casualties when under heavy fire. We're not under heavy fire right now, so we're good. There we go. Just attacking these guys. Yeah, we're doing fine, boys. Victory. Easy victory at that. I mean, that was very easy. <laughs> we defeated them. We're... We basically destroyed them. That was unbelievable. All right, well, let's end this uh, this battle, boys. Decisive victory. You can tell me that, all right. We lost. Like I'm still losing more people than I should. Uh, that than uh, normally it would give me uh, the amount of losses and everything. But uh, in an auto resolve, but I still like. Like it's really enjoyable when you are so OP and stuff. It's really fun to do the battles. Now, unfortunately, I was too concentrated to actually look at the battle in time, like go close to the ground and stuff to look at the units. But uh, next time, I'll do that next time, boys. Don't worry. I'll look at the units. Now that I know how OP my units are um, on the ground. No worries. Uh, I'll show you all, guys, what they look like. Okay, let's take in the Angelus, boys. Gonna take the city or the region in itself, Let's occupy it, and our, I guess it's done now. So uh, they are done for. I guess I think they are done for, boys. Their uh, their faction is destroyed, so that's really good for us. We got the entire region. Really good for us. Do we even have a religion? We do. So we're gonna go for sanitation over here. Uh, we're gonna upgrade. We've got some new skills for our general, so we're gonna upgrade him. There we go. Give him a bunch of upgrades. We're gonna go for campaign spotting chains, uh, line of sight, construction. No, um, I guess morale. There we go. We're gonna give him that. Uh, do we have any bonuses? No, no bonuses. So we're good. Now, what's the next thing we can do? Really, we got um, got all of this. Uh, I'm gonna keep him at uh, where he is for now. We got the Danes right here. We got the Jutes that we could destroy because the Jutes are only one city. So I think that's my next target, boys. It's gonna be the Jutes, my next target. Yeah, my the Jutes are gonna be my next target for sure. Um, it's gonna be pretty interesting. I kind of want to be friends a little bit. Let's try to be a little bit of friends with these guys. They don't want to, but hey, I've got some money for you. You want it? There we go. You want that money for sure. Um, 
Anybody else who's friends with me? Not really. So for anybody else, the Jutes are really not friendly with us, and um, don't feel like do they have? They don't have any allies and stuff. So yeah, we should be fine, boys. We're gonna attack these guys next. All right, they're they're gonna be our next target for sure. Uh, anything else? No, I really looked at that. So we're good, boys. Let's just skip to the next turn. See what um. What's gonna happen before I forget though, I do want to send this guy over here. My I wanna send my spy over here to look at a region. It's not a spy, it's actually someone who's a, a priestess. There we go. But uh it's, it does the same job, so I don't I don't mind. I don't I don't care really. We got one of our generals that died. I hope it's not the king, uh boys, because I, my heir, my son is not ready to be an heir, so I hope it's not him. Uh, let's just get wild, a uh, wild without, I guess. It's pretty cool. Okay, no, it's not. It wasn't my king, so we're good. It wasn't my king, boys. Um, let's get some uh, upgrades for our cities. We got some a bunch of cities that need to up be upgraded right now. So let's look around, see we which ones. We need to upgrade and stuff. I think it's most of them. It's the food and stuff. Resources as well. Yeah, that's a bunch of food that we need to upgrade. Uh, bells as well. We can't forget about our new city right here. Um, well, we have the food. We have the religion. Now we're going to need sanitation. Actually, we're going to need industry. Uh, the artisan because, of course, like we all know, we need uh, as much people as possible here. I really don't like the fact that there's the uns right here that are basically looking at uh, the territory. They're uh, pretty close. The other nomads as well. These guys, the Antian separatists, are right beside our territories. I don't like that whatsoever. This is something that uh, I do not appreciate at all. But we should be alright. Um, what else do we have? This. This is really good. That's a really good stat. So, um, do we have anything else that we need to upgrade here? No, it doesn't look like it. These guys got destroyed basically by um, the Western Roman Empire. The rebels are really not doing too well, boys. So, 55 years of age for the king. Um, and he's 14 years old. Original. Uh, the original king died at 51. So, already my king right now is already pretty, like, he's getting pretty old. And he is, he's finding a way to resist and stuff. So that's really interesting. It really is interesting, boys. Uh, to see how strong he, he really is becoming. He's really becoming strong and stuff. And, uh, like, he's resistant. 54, 54, 5 years of age. He's still there. Um, like, he's a pretty, he's a pretty, pretty strong king, boys. He's resisting a long time. Got a mission that succeeded, uh, a guy that died from natural causes and stuff, uh, causes. So let's see what we got here, uh, the cities and stuff. Florenja is actually his own city. Uh, no, it's, it's owned by the Ostrogoths. So the Ostrogoths have Florenja, boys. All right, that's interesting. They, they are getting invaded from this side, uh, from Italy, instead of being like attacked from by the barbarians from uh, Europe basically boys from the Western Europe so that's the most interesting part right there right uh, it's gonna be interesting to see how uh, Western Empire uh, the Western Empire survives and stuff or if it is gonna survive at all I doubt it because usually it doesn't survive all right it really doesn't uh, construction hostile agent uh, I'm gonna do I guess camping spotting chance and for the armor a growing chance, armor 15. I'm going to do this one. There we go. Uh, I'm going to check that my two armies right here that need to be in the cities. So you need to be in belts. Uh, belts, we need to upgrade you. So we're going to upgrade you with the onagers. Uh, we got this. That's good. And where's my other army? Okay, it's already in the city. It's already good. We're good to go. So that's really cool. We're good, boys. So, we're gonna upgrade Angelus. There we go. And we can start attacking, I think. 
Let me check upon. Yes. Uh, this is my key. No, this is not. Uh, this isn't it. Okay, I felt for a second. Felt wrong for a second there, boys. But fifty-six. He's getting here. He's getting older, boys. He can't have any other child. That's for sure because his wife is dead. Uh, the king. The like the son is getting up there in age, but not fast enough. <laughs> I mean, the the. The king, I'm, I swear it's gonna happen, boys, where the king is gonna be Tyrodemir. It's gonna happen. It's gonna be here, uh, him, and that's not good. That's not what I want at all. I, I want the same, like, the original family to be, to stick with being the king and stuff, but whatever. We're gonna attack these guys right here. The Jutes, I think. Let's see. Yeah, the Jutes. We're gonna attack them. And they don't really like us, so there we go. Their allies are the Danes. Where the, wait, there, they are allied with the Danes. It's not good. The Danes joined them. All right, so we are at war with the Danes as well. Uh, now, do they have a wall? They don't have a wall, boys. Uh, they have a big army. They have three thousand soldiers ready to go, boys. Three thousand soldiers. We've got two thousands. Uh, two thousand. We're gonna go ahead and do the battle. We're gonna go ahead and do the battle. See how it goes. And, uh, I mean, you already saw how OP we are in, uh, in the ground and stuff, so let's do it. Let's do a battle. I'm ready, boys. Let's do it. Uh, I am gonna... Let's look at our units really quick, what they look like before we start the battle. Have our, uh, our little units right here. Actually, let's do... How do we... I want to see really quick. How do we... Hmm... I don't know how to hide the battle thing and stuff. Toggle radar. That's not what I want to do. I, I'm just searching for the way to... to control... Show, show battle units. I don't want to show the battle units. Um, I don't know how to um, actually look at them properly. Got my general right here, boys. And, uh, I'm gonna say, I don't know, boys. I don't know how to properly, like, not do anything. Let's just start the battle. The battle time. Where are they at? I don't even know. Okay, they're uh, right here. So we're gonna use our armies, of course. We're gonna start attacking them. There we go. Start uh, firing at will. So my catapults are firing at uh, their in their soldiers, of course. There we go. Make it get in better position and stuff. Let's get steady. The enemy has been spotted. There we go. My uh, armies are starting to attack. Now I'm gonna. I want to have a better view and stuff. I don't know how to do that though. Do I do like F? 10 or F11, no. I don't know how to do it, boys. But, advisor, chat, menu. What about options? Alright, let's try it out, boys. Ah, oh, there we go. That's what I wanted, boys. Look at that view. Look at that view. That cinematic view, boys. Now I can just do that and go back. Now we are getting attack over here. Attack them, attack them. That's not good at all. We're getting attacked. Uh, what we're gonna need to do is start mo uh, is start moving right here. We're gonna need to start moving. Ah, uh, damn it. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna move these three units. I'm gonna start attacking them. I'm gonna move them over there because I need to protect my... Yeah, there we go. I need to protect my soldiers. It's not good at all, boys. Can't let them do that at all. There we go. We're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, come back over here. I want all my units to actually move up. Form up, move up. Same thing goes for uh, the units that are my archers, basically. Form up. There we go. Just form up like this. And my general, you can uh, stay over there. Actually move up a little bit. There we go. We're good, boys. We're good. You can go back into um, you can go back into your your catapults. 
so you can start attacking again let's actually there we go i'm gonna actually create some fear into these guys there you go create some fear uh, just stay there just stay there and as of my armies uh, my soldiers precision shot there we go and now just gonna go ahead and ask these guys to fire at will attack i guess over here now uh, we're gonna press c again so we can have the cinematic view oh we can actually fire ourselves we can fire ourselves but that's not what i wanted to do i i just want to uh, see my armies from here there we go that's a nice screenshot right there boys that's a nice screenshot. There we go. That's what I like to see a lot. Look at that. Look at this battle, boys. This is unbelievable. I don't know how to... How to get uh, that out of the way. I don't know how to like get rid of the zoom thing. Yeah, I don't want to... I don't want the zoom thing, but uh, it's kind of annoying me a little bit. Uh, the zoom thing is kind of annoying me a little bit, boys. I have to deal with that. Uh, nonsense. Just escape. Yeah. Anyways. I'm having fun right now. I'm trying to show the controls while they're doing their work. I'm going to uh, make them steady a little bit. There we go. So they can do more damage and stuff. I guess you can start attacking over there. Oh, they're gonna start moving. Ah, uh, don't, don't, don't move, I guess. Or maybe move, I don't know, boys. It's unbelievable, really. I really like it a lot. The way it looks. It's beautiful, it's really just beautiful, plainly. Let's see, uh, from his point of view. It's really cool. Let's check, uh, let's try to fire a fire boy ourselves. See what we got. Oh, we missed it. And yeah, we missed it. I'm gonna try to shoot it. I'm gonna try to get it, boys. Over there. There we go. And I doubt, no, we didn't get it. Was That wasn't far enough, but that's okay. Let's get out of this. We're gonna get back into position because they're gonna get us from the front. So, all of this right here, this army right here. Okay, you. I don't know what you're doing, my boy, my guy. You're not doing that for uh, from this side right now. All right, you're not. Attack him! Attack him! Okay, we're gonna have to attack him with our general. There we go. Don't know why he was uh, going this way for some reason. We're gonna try to put our catapults right here because they're gonna attack us in a minute. That's not good at all. Oh yeah, now now, now. Uh, they've got the. There we go. They've got their cavalries right here, which is not good. Okay, let's get everybody in position. Everybody in position. There we go. We're just going to put them uh, in the, the right position so that I can move them back uh, properly afterwards. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put everyone right here the way they are, uh, they are set. I'm just going to put them uh, right here. There we go. Let's put them back. Run. Run, run, run. Start running. I'm going to um, create some diversions with uh, my catapults. They're going to start attacking them. And we should be good. We should be good. They're going to be my armies are going to be fine. They're going to be they're going to have some damage. They're going to be dealt with the, uh, to them, but that's okay. Come on, boys. Get faster, get ready faster. Come on, come on, come on. Got some uh catapults right here. There we go, my Archers are almost in, uh, almost already in position, which is really good. 
Actually, I want to check something out really quick. Uh, let me see, boys. Time to see what the battle looks like from this side. Oh my god. You still have the... Um, look at this, boys. Holy shit. That's unbelievable. Let's get a closer look. Actually, let's uh, create some... Uh, there we go, some doubt into them. I'm gonna get some catapult in here. You stay here, buddy. Because we don't need you to do anything stupid. There we go. You guys are good. You guys are good. Way good. There we go. Can create some uh, damage. Unbelievable damage right here. Okay, these guys are still attacking. We're going to send my general right here to attack them. There we go. I'm going to send my general to attack them. Because they're going to try to attack my catapult again. They're going to succeed in that. That's not good at all. It's really not good. Alright, boys. All of you. I want precision shot. Precision shot. Come on. There we go. Finish them off. My right, general. We're good. Alright, we defeated them, boys. So that was a big, big battle. I couldn't get... I'm gonna have to figure out how to get the proper, like... I've got the cinematic mode. But... I don't know, boys. For some reason... Maybe uh, that's the thing. I don't know. I've got cinematic mode, but it, it was still showing me the thing where it was telling me to left click and stuff. I hate that. I don't need the information and stuff, but let's just end the battle already. And uh, we're good. I don't know if I got a, a good enough image for a thumbnail and stuff. I want my thumbnail, boys. But let's get the fire. We, we did lose 500 soldiers because I didn't, like, um, I didn't mistake. When they came, the reinforcements came from the left. I wasn't prepared for that. I forgot about them. So that was the that was what dealt the most damage to me. But look at the damage. Look at the damage, man. 220, 295, 346. Like my archers are dealing so much damage. It's it's crazy. On with the defeat for them. There we go. We're gonna take their cities now. Or the uh, basically Alibu. We're gonna take Alibu. We lost a lot of soldiers for that though. But uh, let's occupy the place. We're gonna have to take care of these bad boys right here. Uh, we do have the Jutes to take care of as well. So lots of stuff going on. We do have some upgrades though. So that's really good. Really good in the long term for us. Yeah we, uh, we got a lot of damage dealt to us. But that's alright boys. Let's repair all of that. Alabu is ours, boys. We're getting, we're continuing our assault, basically our ex expansion. Now I'm gonna stick to what I said. If they want to try to attack a uh, Rujian, that's fine. I think I'm just gonna end it for this episode, though, boys. Let me just make sure that my, yeah, I can't do anything with my spy and stuff. All right, so we're good. So. I'm going to end it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to see you guys for the next one. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Keep it easy boys.